Hey guys, what's up? This is Nate here with Nate's Tech Update. And over the past couple of days, I've been receiving a lot of comments and messages about how I got iOS 5 Beta 1 on my iPhone. So in this video, I'm going to clear a lot of things up for you guys and answer a lot of your questions that you guys have been leaving so I don't have to keep replying to the same comments over and over again. So to start off, in order to get iOS 5 Beta 1 on your device, you're either going to need to be an Apple developer or have your uh, UDID registered. So to become an Apple developer, you can pay $99 per year uh, through Apple's website and allow you to develop apps as well as um, install iOS 5 Beta 1 on your device. Now if you're like me and you don't actually develop apps, it's kind of a ripoff to pay $99 in order to use the new features in iOS 5. So what I did was I got my UDID registered. A UDID is basically a number that separates your device from all the other Apple devices out there. It makes your device unique. So companies out there will register your UDID. In other words, these companies have paid the $99 membership to actually become an Apple developer. And one of the benefits of becoming an actual Apple developer is to allow other people to beta test the applications that you're working on in iOS 5 Beta 1. Apple does this by registering your UDID, which is the uh, unique number that we talked about earlier. So these companies will charge you um, a price and they will register your UDID under them so you can install iOS 5 beta. So the website that I used was iModZone Download and they charge you seven dollars which is the cheapest price that I've been able to find um, if you simply search you did uh, activation in Google you'll find a whole bunch of other websites if you find the one that's a cheaper price be sure to leave a comment below and uh, I'll update the video um, so basically if you're into doing this and you want to try the new features of the iOS 5 beta 1 you're going to need to enter your UDID here. So in order to get the UDID from your device, I would recommend installing this application called UDID. It's available in the App Store for free. It'll work with your iPhone or iPad, and it will basically give you all the information about your device, but the number that you'll be really interested in is right here where it says UDID. And you can basically copy and paste this to your email, open the email up on your computer, then copy and paste that, and simply put it right into here. And then this company will take your UDID, register it under them on their actual d uh, developer account with Apple, and in a couple hours, Apple will register that UDID. This will allow you to actually install the iOS 5 beta software through iTunes because Apple will recognize your device as being authorized through a developer account. If you go ahead and try to install iOS 5 without actually having a developer account, your device will not be able to complete uh, the update because you are not actually authorized to run that software on your device. So this will allow you to also install any future betas that come up, even iOS 6, as long as you keep the same device. But I should know if you ever upgrade your iPhone, iPad, or iPod Touch, you will have to pay the $7 again if you want to run beta software on your device because you will have a completely new UDID. So in, ac in order to actually get the um, software then, the iOS 5 beta software, you can simply click on that downloads button there that I just did and you can go down here and find your device and you'll see it says iOS 5 beta 1. You can simply choose the one that you have, so I had the iPhone 4 GSM iOS 5 beta 1. You simply download it and then choose to restore through that IPSW file in iTunes. So I hope this cleared some things up for you guys. Um, once again, I am not an actual developer, so I cannot give you guys free UDID activations, but there are services out there that will do it for a pretty cheap price. I mean, seven bucks is a lot better than paying $99. Once again, I hope this video cleared some things up for you guys. If you have any additional questions, uh, be sure to leave a comment below and I'll be sure to get back to you as soon as I can. Uh, please like the video, subscribe, and as always, have a nice day.